Now, I'm going to give you a first question. Which of the following differentiates fever from hyperthermia? You need to be able to tell the difference between fever and hyperthermia in the MCQ one. So I'm going to make the screen bigger and then you will tell me which of the following differentiates fever from hyperthermia? A, presence of elevated body temperature. B, one is triggered by infection. C, there's a change in the hypothalamic set point in one of them. D, response to antipyretics. And E, involves vasodilation. Okay, so which of the following different, differentiates fever from hyperthermia? A, the presence of elevated body temperature. B, triggered by infection. C, change in hypothalamic set point. D, response to antipyretics. And E, involves vasodilation. Doctors, it looks like everybody got it wrong. The correct answer is C. Remember that we said that fever is controlled by the hypothalamus. Now, hyperthermia occurs when the body's ability to ward off excessive heat is over overcome. So you realize that fever is controlled by the hypothalamus, but hyperthermia occurs when heat dissipation mechanisms, that is when hyperthermia occurs. So please make sure that you know that very well, okay?